I sound like a little clown horn. Hi there. Welcome back. This is my new buddy. Got him on Black Friday. If you couldn't tell, <coughs> I'm extremely sick. And I don't have a voice right now. Due to my wonderful procrastination skills, I have a bunch of work I need to do. I have to write a 10-page script. And you liked my last script video? So I figured, hey, I need a video and I need to write a script. Why not just do both? Let's write a script together, yeah? I already have the rough idea for what I'm gonna do for the script. I've had this idea for a while. You like my One Direction stickers? Wish me luck. Apartment. I don't remember how to write a script. Afternoon. <laughs> I'm gonna go to photo booth because I don't have to have my phone sitting on my bed. So, <laughs> why have we never done this before? I what? Your assignments? Um. <laughs> no, I've I've done almost all of them. <laughs> Love is an open door. Wow, I've been recording for fifty-two minutes and forgot. <laughs> How do I? Is, he's in his car, but he's outside the. I don't know how to write this. I'm gonna say interior car. No. Yes. No. Yes. Ah, that hurts so bad. <laughs> I I wish I could go with you guys. I want to. They're gonna go see the play again, and I want to go, but I don't think I can. And I'd have to buy my ticket in like 45 minutes. I'm trying to convince my mom. That is not the worst idea in the world for me to go see. Actually, you know what? I'm not. I can't. I shouldn't go. I should not go. Wait, I should. Where? I should let you to the play with you guys tonight. But I have to get all my work done. I'd have to buy my ticket like right now, and I have to get all my work done. Buy your ticket right now. But I have to get my work done. You want to write my ten-page script for me? Okay, I'm gonna give myself ten minutes to think about it. You guys need to try to convince me, mom. You need to try to convince me not to. Oh no. <clears throat> what no? It's not, the ticket's not coming up anymore. Well, oh, guess I'm not going. You can call Ooh, them. yeah, listen, I'm not paying 25 bucks. I'll be back. I got a pink. I got a twinkie. are lined with photos and memories. Hung on the wall is a high school diploma from 2010. Next to it is a degree in lighting design, both with the name Drew Turner. Several photos in frames show a young Drew with a girl. This is Sadie. One shows the pair dressed in formal attire. The frame reads, Drew plus Sadie, prom 2010, BFFS. Other photos show Drew with young man. One in particular is from the yearbook. Most likely to be friends forever, Drew and Joey. There is a flyer near the photos on a table, MCHS 10-year reunion, class OF 2010, June 18, 2020. There is steam and music coming from a room nearby. Drew off-screen. Hey Sadie. Wow. You look stunning. Interior bathroom, continued drawn onto a steamy mirror is a stick figure with long hair. Drew with a towel around his waist, face half full of shaving cream, and razor in hand looks at the stick figure. Drew continued. How crazy is this? 
We haven't seen some of these people in 10 years. I haven't seen you since New Year's at that. What was it? Oh right. That ball drop thing you hosted on NBC. That was such a coincidence that I'd be lighting the event you were hosting. What was that? Oh. You're in a new movie? Sadie that's awesome. Congrats. Interior bedroom. Continued Drew tucks his lilac shirt into his trousers and is holding up different colored ties in the mirror. Drew continued. What have I been up to? Oh, you know. Typical lighting stuff. Did a few red carpet lightings recently. Nothing like you though, Sadie. I'm not the one oh and the red carpets. The actress life, that's something else. Hey so remember when we saw each other over New Year's? Remember what we did to celebrate that night? No? Maybe you'd be interested in coming back to my place tonight and I can try to jog your memory, if you know what I mean? Drew tosses the ties in a drawer and unbuttons the top few buttons of his shirt. He runs his hands through his hair and sighs. He flops on his bed in defeat. A moment passes before he sits back up. He slides on some dress shoes and walks out his door. Interior apartment, continued Drew stands in the foyer. He stands by the picture frames and grabs his keys. He looks at the prom photo and smiles. He shakes his keys in his hand and grabs the reunion flyer before rushing out his door. Enter a car, later sitting in his car, Drew waits in the high school parking lot. He watches couples go into the gym in nice clothes. Drew. Guess we're all trying to impress someone. He rhythmically taps his thumbs on his steering wheel. His phone rings on the passenger seat next to the flyer. He checks the ID. Joey's face shines on the screen. Drew answers the phone and loud music blasts through the speaker. Drew. Hey, Joe. Joe is shouting through the phone. Drew. Are you coming? People are asking me about you. They have an open bar. I'm parked out front. I don't know if I should go. I mean, everyone I want to see are people that I can see whenever I want. I don't see a reason to be here. Listen to me, Drew. Open bar. I heard that Sadie's going to be here. Come on, you want to see Sadie. The Sadie Martin. Thank you so much for watching. Oh my god, it got worse. <clears throat> Thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, thumbs up. <laughs> I'll see you in my next video. Bye. <laughs>3.30. We still working. I'm done. Good night.